Here's for all you ring collectors like myself. I found this frame at Hobby Lobby and I took the back off where the stand was and I just went over and painted the image that had some words on it with a Waverly chalk paint in an off-white. I wanted to cover up those words so I gave it two coats of the chalk paint and let it dry in between each coat. Once I had that nice and dry, I took some paper, a really pretty floral from the Decoupage Queen. It is a rice paper, it's super easy to use, and if you love to decoupage, this paper is so easy to work with. I do have it linked over on my website for you to find. I cut it out to the space on the inside of the frame. and I simply Mod Podged it on there after getting the size done correctly and fit just right. The rice paper from Decoupage Queen is so easy to work with. You don't get a lot of wrinkles. It's a little bit thicker and it's just awesome stuff. Definitely go check them out. I laid that down and then went over it with another coat of Mod Podge to seal that rice paper down. I hit it with my heat gun just to make sure that it was nice and dry. And after I had that all done, I took these acrylic ring holders that I found on Amazon. I have those linked on my website as well, as well, and I just simply glued them on. I put the first two on the bottom and the top and then just worked my way to fill in the rest of the space. I ended up being able to use five of them and they fit perfectly across the eight by 10 picture frame that I had found at the Hobby Lobby. I then added on some of my favorite Totally Dazzled Bling to the top and the bottom just to give it a little bit of glam. And then I added in all of my rings. I love costume jewelry, so this is a great way for me to keep it all in one place and easily accessible. They make perfect Christmas gifts too.